All right, we may as well cut to the chase. Um, so I had to look around a little bit to figure out where I was supposed to be going again. We know there's a dead end in the top left corner of the forest that uh, I have to come back with once I get the wand. And uh, this dungeon entrance seems to be the one with the most promise because it actually leads to a large chunk. You may also notice that the uh, boss that was here is now gone. This was the screen where uh, if you play the whistle, it uh, you know causes issues and so there was no way to kill it. But uh, I found a workaround because no whistle flag on the chest. So I did that. I had no reason to share that other than, you know, boasting my own abilities to think outside the cocks. So, um, we established last time that the uh, compass in the middle of this area is japes. Collecting it just disables the entire map, so we definitely don't want to actually do that. Uh, other than that, there was just various fuckery to be had with the, uh... Yeah, there was, like, something with that. There was... Man, I already don't fucking remember. <laughs> this is the danger of recording, you know, one part of a very confusing section of the game and then having to wait a week before doing more. I could have done more throughout the week, but I didn't, so this is what we're stuck with. There's uh, definitely more stuff that can be explored, though. Um, I don't remember if we took that upper staircase. I feel like I did. That might have actually been what, uh, that might have been what led to the outside area. I'm going to check real quick. Okay, it claims that there's only one tile warp on this screen, which is... Yeah, okay, whatever, let's just... I want to see what this one does. So, let's, you know, get killed by the spikes in the process, of course, because this sucks. Ah, okay, yeah, that's what happens. I mean, really, I expected nothing less. And we have been in here, right? Yes, actually, because this is what led to the whole thing with, like, there was the kid that was dying and all that, and... Yeah, okay, so can we go back in? Yes, but not to an area that I wanted, necessarily. Um... What happens if I just do this? Nothing. I'm afraid to move. I feel like, uh... Any second, something's gonna happen to me, but... Eh, maybe not. Oh, okay, there it goes. Yeah, that's not a pleasant surprise. Um... Yeah. You know, given the amount of damage I took from the spikes, I was kind of fine with that anyway. Alright, uh, where is this going to put me? Way the fuck back. Yep, okay. I could just cut this entire intro, but nah, this is fine. Okay, let's try that again. So, uh, maybe only the way to the right had a sudden warp? I'm guessing that wasn't the case. It's probably both sides, but yeah. This time I at least have the health to survive it, so that's... Fine. I have no reason to uh, suspect that this reason, or the, you know, this direction in particular is going to yield any results, but uh, I've got, you know, a whole big dungeon to explore. Let's just try to be as methodical as possible here. I don't actually remember if I've ever even taken the raft path going down. So, check that after we clear out whatever is in this direction. Come on. Okay. So, on the map, I think... It's hard to... You know, I can't really tell because the pause screen doesn't show it. I think I was, like, here originally. And then I... Went through the... I, I, like, warped outside, warped back in, and then I was here. And then... Trying to go up 
led me to the screen I'm currently on. I think that's how all that connects. Uh, that top section looks fucking awful. I don't think I want to do that. If I have any way to avoid it, then uh, I would like to take that opportunity. This looks uh, definitely more manageable. Is this... Uh, yeah, that's conveyor belts and spikes and shit. I don't even know if you can get through that without taking damage, so... Ah, of course, we burned the blocks. I forgot, it's this game. Okay. Alright. I have a feeling walking in front of this eye is gonna do something bad, but I wanna find out. Yeah, okay. Was that a... Hold on. Okay, so that is a trigger. That's not a staircase warp. That's actually hidden. The Lens of Truth doesn't show it. That's surprising. Okay. Uh, I do like how these levers can't get out because the uh, exit is between two tiles. That's interesting. Alright, where are you going to take me? I recognize this from looking at it in Z-Quest. Um, I think I know what's going to happen here. Let me go down a screen before I say anything about it. Does this sign do anything? The fuck? Okay. No, the sign does not do anything. Okay, so this screen... Um, uh, you know, I, the only reason I know this is because I was trying to figure out where I needed to go next before I started the video, and I was just kind of looking around, and I happened to see this. Um, I believe there's an invisible staircase tile right in front of me here that I don't want to take. Because it, I think if I do, it warps me back to the start of the fucking woods. So we want to go this way. And then this screen we've seen before... Because this was the top of the part where you kind of, like, went up and then back down. And there was, like, the wind pushing you into the spikes. Um. And the purpose of this screen is hidden staircase. Um, and now... The cheetah man. I suppose we, uh, wait until the Stalfos decides to get in a place that I can kill it. Okay, that didn't matter. Before I even look at the lens. Hookshot? Damn it. Uh, no, okay, that was correct. Never mind. Alright. Fuck. Okay, no, it just reset the room. That's fine, I guess. What was I supposed to do there? Ah, yes, bomb of the spike. Why didn't I think of that? Because if I don't bomb the spike and walk where it was, walking up is an invisible warp to the beginning. So, you know, Mitch puzzles. Okay. Alright, the treasure chest is on fire. Do I want it to be on more fire? Come on. I, I can see those different floor tiles with the lens. I'm concerned that approaching this is going to be a problem. No, eh, maybe not. I don't know if I have any other ranged attacks. Okay, did I dodge something? I've got to know. Let's find out. So while we're looking here, let's verify. So this led out and then back up, and it led here. This had, yeah, both sides were... Okay, pit warps. I was like, are those actually triggers? No, those are pit warps. Um, to the screen directly above it, which has the patches in it. Clear that shit out, we go up here. Um, yeah, this screen is, I believe, exactly what it looks like. It's fine. This screen's just a warp. We have this shit. 
here's the invisible tile warp here, which leads to screen 47, which is the entrance, so yeah, fuck you. Um, then this warped to here, we solved the puzzle there. Uh, not quite seeing the significance. Oh, there were multiple hidden pits, what the fuck? Or warps, whatever. I think I just happened to guess correctly, unless they got disabled. No? Yeah, I guess I just... I don't know, whatever, it was a stupid fucking puzzle, regardless. Um, also, what do you mean 20? I bombed that. Oh, because... Right, it was a tiered secret. Hookshotting this made this bombable, I think, right? Yeah, combo 20 has a bomb flag on it. Okay, whatever. So we did that. Here were... Oh, item god screens. Am I actually supposed to go in the chest? I didn't even think about that. Shit, okay. Alright, if I had not hookshot ac hookshot it across this... Um, first of all, apparently these can be disabled, according to this. Uh, I... Uh, have yet to see evidence of that being the case, but okay. If I hadn't done that, then there were warps. Oh! Okay, wait. Secrets print. What the fuck did I do here? Hold on. Did I, like, outthink the dungeon and, like, actually fuck myself? Hold on. So this is just nothing. If I'm reading this correctly, then what I was supposed to do was not use the lens and foresee an issue, and walking up would have led to a tile warp to an item screen of some description. And then, like, presumably get put back onto these buttons to disable it permanently. Because it says secret's permanent. That's not good. Um, now, it might be a troll item screen. And I could very easily check that by looking at where it points me, but I don't want to necessarily see that yet. Um... I don't like that. I don't have a way to get back down there. If I continue warp, it's gonna make me reset everything, isn't it? Yeah, well, I gotta find out. Alright, let's see if it was uh, worth the effort of coming back here. Life ends here really bad. Okay, so... For a minute there, I was really concerned that, yes, I could indeed have dodged that permanently. Um... But no, that was a fake out. So, it just disables the cutscene for any other time that you come through here. That's fine, I guess. It's a little weird that the chest was on fire and all that, but, I mean, it's this fucking quest. So, or, more accurately, it's this dungeon. It, nothing here is supposed to make sense, so that's fine. Hey, it's old Kentucky Shark. Been a while since we've seen you. Um, Alright, so that's the boss door, obviously. Um, is there... What the hell? None of these blocks look like they should be pushable, so I will assume that they just aren't. Um, I'm not sure why the uh, the lens blocks. I won't question it for now. Obviously, we'll have to come back here later. Thank <laughs> you. 
this uh, bomb for results. No, but it's something, all right. Just wanting me to come back with the wand. Um, okay. Shit. Have we been to this part of the woods? Before I even leave the screen. Okay, no. I've got multiple paths. Fuck. Um... I have to choose- I have to decide here. Do I value, you know, me- oh, Fuck. So, was that a- Yes, it's the fucking electric floor. God damn it. Okay, I was gonna say, before I got rudely interrupted by that shit, um, do I value me attempting to figure stuff out on my own more than, you know, saving time? Um, I'm just gonna pick a direction and hope. Because knowing this, you know, I'll go down, it's gonna lead to some stupid shit. And then I try to go back up, and it's going to warp somewhere else, but let's see. Uh, what I have expected has happened, but in this case, I don't think it mattered. Because we've definitely seen this screen before. Um, I don't remember what the music prompt did, but I don't think it was anything that I cared about. Okay, thankfully we can warp back here. Um, well, that was a sequence of events. Well, we've got plenty more places to explore, so... Let me go back there yet again, and this time try rafting down. Let's see if that leads to anything. I don't remember if I've already checked it. I probably have. So, you know get to watch it all over again. This is feeling pretty damn familiar. I don't remember where it went, though. Uh, oh, right. It was a waste of my time. Of course. They verify in ZQuest that that was indeed the case. Um, where's, uh... Yeah, 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 skipping around. Okay. Yeah, nothing gets rid of those. This room is, uh, absolutely a waste of time. Okay, that's fine. I don't think I missed anything else along the way. I feel like I checked every other room pretty thoroughly. Also, I gotta definitely keep an eye out on uh, my money. Anytime that I use arrows to kill stuff, I need to get back up to max, because I never know when fucking Dynamo is gonna show up and rob me of all my hard-earned money. So, that's always fun. Uh, right from here is the fuck you compass, right? Yes, okay. Fuck you compass is going to prevent me from cutting through the middle of this first floor. Because I would like to keep the map, if that is at all possible. I see we've uh, brought in my favorite enemy, the Blue Wiz Robe. Unless that's a Mirror Robe. Oh, it's a Wind Robe, even better. Okay, at least I was near the beginning of the dungeon anyway. Okay, so... The, uh... The White Wiz Robes... Try not to get caught by them. They're bad. For anyone who doesn't recall, I mean, you saw the effects of it right there, but a wind robe is... A wind robe that shoots a fucking tornado at you that sends you to the beginning of the dungeon like a wall master would. They are very shitty enemies. They're not hard to kill, but they're a massive pain in the ass. I will have a room in BA3 that contains 10 of them and no way to avoid them. It'll be super cool. Except there will be a secret way to avoid them and you have to do that to progress. You think I'm joking? I actually don't know if I'm joking. I very well might do this. Hey! Harry! I'm ready to buy today. Can I kill this fucker? Yeah, he 
is taking damage. Yeah, they're basically regular shrubs, but with more health. Yeah. Uh, anything here? Looking like no. I actually don't even remember if I checked the previous screen. Obviously, I had a locked door, but I'm holding off on that for the time being. Eh, this all looks about right. I'm, I'm noticing that I... Excuse me, why did all of the enemies come back? I realize we have a splitting dark nut here that's throwing off the enemy count, but I think at worst that should have made, like, two enemies respawn, not fucking all of them. Whatever. Um... But yeah, that locked door on the map does not actually lead to anything, so that's cool. I have a feeling it's going to, uh, just kind of lead up into the forest, because there is a chunk of the forest that I have not explored yet. Um, yeah, middle of the thing. I have no reason to be checking that, but given the abundance of side warps in this fucking dungeon, I shouldn't take anything that should be obvious for granted. Alright, what's over here? Actually, before we even do that, bottom screen. Got the wind robe, got my good old friend the super dark nut, and uh, short of this screen having a kill all enemies reward, there is nothing on it, so yeah, we don't need to bother with that. Alright, this room is suspiciously simplistic looking. Those are just markers for the traps, so I don't care about those. Um, arrow marker. Um, that almost seems too obvious. But, I mean, sure, I'll play the game. You know, rob me of my money so I can have to get more of it for fucking Dynamo later. Uh, okay, that's looking pretty one way to me. Let me just try this one more time. Yeah. Nope, hold on. Again, it's this game. You never know. Okay. Those are, uh, those are basically my options. At least the reasonable ones. Okay, right also appears to be a dead end. Ah! My favorite. Okay. We might have even been on that screen before. I don't know. This place is too complicated to really remember. Get past Horde of Enemies, number 75. We kill you, just so I don't have to deal with you later. Oh! I, I, I knew that was gonna happen, and I was powerless to stop it. I'm like, does this thing die to three hammer swings or four? It's probably four, isn't it? Yes. So, yeah, whatever. It's fine. Sorry, what? Oh, is that just okay? That's... For a second I thought that was indicating that I could walk through that, but no. Enemies don't follow the same solidity rules that Link does. If the if the block is walkable on, like, the bottom half and not the top, it can enemies can usually go through it. So, never mind. That's how I made the, uh, fish move everywhere in the, uh, cave dungeon in BA2. What the fuck? Okay, first of all, secrets. Uh, no immediately out. Oh, I just realized that's a fucking death knight. That's... a problem, okay. For some reason, I didn't register that. I thought it was just a super dark knight. Funnily enough, with, um... So, Death Knights are basically the shittiest enemy in the game. They do, what is it, 16 hearts of damage in one hit? Um, without, with, with like, you know, with no ring. They do an unreasonable amount of contact damage, which I think is less than the 16 from their projectiles, but still. They have a ton of health, they're really fast. However, having the red ring and this many hearts and the hammer is going to make it tolerable, I, I would say. Yeah, oh god. 
Nope. Nope. Bad. Bad. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, there's no other secrets on screen because I did the thing. Okay. Uh, hopefully that thing stays dead forever, and here we are down here now. Sure. Because, again, it's Mitch dungeon design. Things don't have to make sense. Okay. At this point, I feel like I might have checked everything other than the locked door, so let's take a look and see if I've missed anything. Um... Okay, none of these screens have any warps on them. This one does, but we already checked that. Uh, side warp east to 43. Yeah, we did that. Okay, down led to this shit. Nothing particularly interesting on this one. Just, yeah, no tiered secrets or anything. Okay. Uh... And then this screen had the fucking Death Knight killing that just opened the door. Does this have a, like, proper dungeon door on it? How do you even check that in this? Nobody ever fucking uses the NES doors. So, like... Hold on. Oh, is it just it disables? Yeah, it just disabled layer one. Never mind, it's not an NES door. Okay. Side warp north goes to this. Yeah, at this point, I've, I'm reasonably confident I've checked everything other than the locked door, so let us head over and do that and see if it's what I predicted. Yeah, after I pay a visit to my good friends, the skeletons, again. Nope, can't go up through the middle, because we're going to collect the compass. Because, uh, this dungeon respects my time. I mean, hell, even I don't respect my time. Dungeon's not doing anything now. Alrighty, what are we doing? Yep, okay. Oh, hello, Fire Wiz Robe. Bro. Okay. Well, we've reached a new part of the woods that I've not seen, so this, uh, you know, opens up all new questions of do warps lead where they came from, our side, so the screen to be trusted? Who knows? What does this lead to? Surprisingly, exactly where it should be. And I see the fucking wizard respawned. Great, okay. Um, I have no recollection of where I have and haven't been in the, you know, nondescript 8x8 map that I can't see. So, let's just go right and hope for the best. I have chosen poorly. I'll see you in a bit. Uh, never mind, when I said I'll see you in a bit, I meant, uh, in two seconds, because doing an F6 continue actually put me back here, shockingly. Alright, so, now the only question is, left or right? Because it might matter. Alright. Oh, okay. Don't cut the grass. Cutting the grass is bad. Yeah. Alright, uh, there's a big fucked up looking tree here. I can't tell if it's enterable or if it's just decoration. I'm trying to kill this stupid little blob. Um, tree... Looks like it's just decoration. Okay, I can't... Are these enemies or are these damage combos? These are enemies. These blobs have gotta go. Okay, big fucked up tree does not do anything. Anything hidden in the grass? Uh, yes, actually. Something very important, in fact. Okay. That's cool. Uh... 
Well, all that's left to do is, you know, try leaving the screen and hope that it doesn't warp me somewhere stupid. At least I can continue back here. I don't think I've seen this house before. This feels new. The problem is, going in this house is probably going to reset my uh, continue spot. So can I actually get back from here? Yes. Okay, that's fine. What is the house? Uh, it's Wizrobes and an item, which I probably get from killing the Wizrobes. You know, if they would not be oppressive motherfuckers. But they are blue as robes, so, you know, they're good at doing that. I hate these goddamn enemies. Out of all the vanilla enemies, I, I'm pretty sure these are my most hated. You know, Zelda Classic has its own new enemies that it's added to the repertoire that suck ass, but, uh... Come on, really? Nothing in here. I mean, okay, if you say so. Although, I don't trust like that. Let's, uh... Oh, I'm like, why is it not displaying the warp info? But that's right, it's because it's... This turns into... Yeah, we saw that in another dungeon. Okay. So, yeah, going right was a mistake. Um... I've seen this. I've seen this. There's no item. There's... Yeah, there, there's nothing in here. Okay. It's just a waste of time. That's fine, I guess. Whatever. Um, so, I'm looking at the screen in ZQuest still, and uh, wouldn't you know it, it says... Side warp north. That doesn't sound good. Um, however, we have the powers of God and anime on our side here. I can always just F6 to return, so. Yeah, this is like. This is the beginning of the forest. We don't want to be here. Okay. Um, is there actually a side exit? It does not look like it. I thought there was at first, but apparently not. Okay. So, back to this, and let's check this way. So far, this looks shockingly normal. Can't wait for it to get mixed up somehow. Ah, there it is. Okay. That's fine. Um, the path to the right is being blocked by these. I can power through it, but I don't... I can just go up, so let's go up. I don't know if this screen has a point. Um, this might just be... Haha, ha, you went the wrong way, you go da you go down and now you're somewhere else. That's exactly what it is. Okay. At least I'm, you know, good at predicting this shit now. Alright, what's over here? More fairly normal looking stuff. I'm not immediately seeing anything that's gonna screw me over when I uh kill the enemies, so start by doing that. Okay. Gotta touch every little nook and cranny, you never know. I haven't done that on other screens, so I'm just being overly paranoid. Alright. What else we got? I've seen this screen in ZQuest. I don't remember what its deal is. There's something being concealed with layers. I remember that much. Um. Mm. 
Okay, so if we take, you know, the pointless bridge, then everything's fine and dandy. It leads to... Oh, this is a shortcut, isn't it? Hold on. That might just be another dungeon entrance. Well, I'm stupid, so let's see what this does. Ah! Pit of snakes. Okay. That's cool. Uh, and then what? What? What the fuck is this? Is that an actual door I can go through? It, why does it look like it's made of glass or something? Oh, whatever, don't question it. Death Knight. You are stuck down there, so I'm going to kill you in the easiest fashion that I can. This may take a while, because they have entirely too much fucking health. Alright. Uh, I'm assuming either direction is fine. Shouldn't matter which. And we're back here. Okay, where is this going to take me if I continue? That's fine. Alright. Let's see what happens after I go into the... Poke the tree with a hookshot cave. It's a good thing I remembered that was a thing, because it's probably going to be progress. Yeah, probably. It's something I haven't seen yet. Um, ah, okay, we can... I guess that makes sense. If that was a statue combo, then it could stop shooting if I do something to it. Um, okay, so hold on. Lock door to the right. Left is... Fucking, I don't know. I don't remember if I've been over there. Let's check it first. Uh, okay. Oh, is that hookshotable? Yeah. Okay, well, we got a warp tile. Um, I, I'm, I'm like, I, I'm so untrusting of everything. If I touch this thing, and that motherfucker comes up and is like, hey, 500 rupees or a heart container, and I'm one short. I'm not going to be very happy. Okay, that's... Honestly, that's fine. I can recover from that just fine. Can I get one more rupee? Thank you. <laughs> I, I know it's happening eventually. I don't know when, but I'm going to be prepared when it does. Unless, you know, this is the one dungeon where that doesn't happen. Alright, well, we got a key, so let's go ahead and use it. Ah, after I walk into spikes, because I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. Twice. That's a large, rapidly growing crystal you've got there. Um, I don't know what to make of this, but uh, I'm guessing it's probably something similar to before, where there's some staircases and triggers that disable said staircases. Let's find out. Last time it was the fire rod. So is the wand supposed to be fire and ice then? Yeah, that's that's not a thing. <laughs> that was pretty bad, but it was kind of funny. Does he have a girly bot? Isn't this just Zero from Mega Man? I called him Proto Man last time, but yeah. Okay, but did I actually, though? 
Uh, yes, okay. The chest contained the ice wand and the key. That's interesting. All right. Uh, now I have to remember how to get back to the place with the boss door. That was, uh... I'll tell you something, it was sure somewhere. Um... Oh, fuck me, how did I get to that? Um... I genuinely don't remember. Let's look at Z-Quest. I have the tools to figure it out. I may as well use them. Um, uh, okay, it was through here. How did I get to this screen? Let's see, it was quest reports. What links here? Two things, apparently. 2, 3, and 2B. Oh, 2B leads to itself, right? So 2, 3 is this, which I got to from going down from here. I got to here by 0B, which I got to by... Was it that staircase? Yeah, and then you go back in. Okay. God, that's convoluted. All right. Um, so, you know, I guess we'll go ahead and take the tour again. I like, I, I especially love the part of this that is, uh, you know, you leave the dungeon and go back in the way you came in order to go somewhere else. Is that, like, right? Because you take this... You go back in. And then, yeah, sure enough. Also, I learned this lesson. Don't hold up here. Because you'll step into the fucking spikes. You gotta give it a second. Alright. At least, uh, once you know where to go, it's not that much trouble to get around. Like, the paths aren't very long. But... Like, I just did that 20 minutes ago, and I already fucking forgot how to do it, so. And then, yeah, this screen, you have to do this, and then... I checked, if you go... If you... One tile north of me is indeed a warp, you have to go around it. I just happened to get lucky that one time. Alright, take my fucking money. Pfft. Nice. Okay, apparently, uh, this game now, you know, has reached third grade levels of insults and is calling everybody little girls. <laughs> oh, that's kind of fucked. You are great! <laughs> the coffee cup says, Link rocks! The... What the fuck is that in the bottom left? <laughs> yeah! Okay, so the solution was just hope really hard. We, we couldn't have done that earlier. And you can... Oh, fuck. Oh, what do you mean you can enter people's dreams? Oh, that's what the hell... Oh, my god. I run the inn with the wand. Oh. Oh, god, what is that gonna be? <laughs> okay, well, that's why the blocks appeared, because the... That is fake. <sighs> okay, well, you know, definite progress has been made. We've got the wand, finally. That's been a long time coming. Um, 
So now I need to get back to the top left, which I do by, uh... Actually, hold on. I was trying to reset to the beginning of the forest, but I don't know if I even need to. I th oh, nope. Never mind, this is not where I want to be. Well, it's where I'm going to fucking stay. Never mind, we're saving. Um... <laughs> Uh, I was trying to see if I could remember how to get back on my own. Um, yeah, I can go in here, probably. I love how the stumps just regenerate. Okay. Uh, I think if I go... Dark Knight, can you leave me alone? Like, for once in my fucking life. I think if I go over here and go outside and then follow this path up, it leads to that place. I'm amazed that I'm remembering this, but that sounds right. Wait. No, because it just fucking... I'm sorry. What? Apparently I'm misremembering this, but I wanna I wanna take a look. Okay, so this screen side warp. Yeah, it's just the beginning of the forest. Okay, that's great. Uh how do I I don't fucking remember. We have to work backwards. I hate this shit. So this is the screen I need to get to. You get here by... That's not what I meant to click. 28 or 30. Uh, come on. Screen 30 is... Okay, yeah, you get from here, from here, from here. That, that. So I need to come out of this and then hook shot over. This is here. Oh god, it's all this stupid shit again. Okay. Was this the Oh my god, my brain. Okay. I don't actually know if I needed to go through the main entrance to get that. I feel like there was a faster way to do this. But it's been so long at this point, I don't remember. There's like... Hold on, if I go down this way... Doesn't this lead to something? Doesn't this let me shortcut some of it? I'm just kind of hoping that that's the case. No, that was just for a key. Shit. And yeah, okay. Well, once again, let's uh, just, you know... Wait, hold on. There's stuff I can do with the wand. There were other screens. God, where were those? Um... Oh, we're delaying shit. I was about to say, did the music get a lot quieter, but no. Um, there is a screen with a bunch of, like, Pulse voices that had a wand flag. Where the hell was that? This is going to lead to the pay attention to the next screen very carefully, which I think is just an infinite loop. Yeah, this screen is just fucking pointless. Okay, um... I think this is Spooky Tree. North of Spooky Tree is Chickens, which has nothing. This way is... Well, it's a pit. Shit. Oh, where was the Pulse Voice screen? Fuck. I'm, I was hoping to remember it on my own, but I'm never going to. Okay, it was... Um, the 
hell is this? I don't remember seeing this screen. Uh, what leads here? 3401. Mm. Oh, no, I did do this. Yeah, okay. Apologies if this is uh, going to be a lot of meandering. I really want to know where the hell that thing was. There was definitely a screen somewhere. We're looking for flag 76. It's uh, bright pink, so it should kind of stand out. Is it just nowhere? No, here it is. Okay. Was it just that one? Weird. I swear there were two of them, but okay. Um, getting here is down. From, okay, so it is just down from the entrance of the woods. I was close. Let us find out what that does. It's probably nothing important. Also, uh, I'm amazed I've gone through this many subsequent screen transitions without there being an unnecessary warp somewhere thrown in. Yes, thank you. You're very cool. Alright. Alright. Wand on this tree for some reason. What are you gonna do? Hey, what do you know? I got fucked over because I accidentally walked off the screen. Love it. We get to go back again. Uh. <laughs> my, my, my feelings on this area are very mixed. I think that it has done some things that are really cool. It's definitely been, you know, keeping me on my toes. Um, making me second guess a lot of stuff. It's been cool. It's just been hella annoying. Alright, where do you lead? Oh, wait. Shit, is this a shortcut to where I needed to go? Hey, it is. Um... So, the game wants me to get rid of this block. Before I do that, um, I want to go back in here and see if this actually had anything that needed the wand. Because I feel like there was a wand check somewhere. Or boss flag check, maybe? Two non-sword items at the same... Okay, the fire and ice rods, that's it. Yeah, no, we've seen this. Um, so I haven't triggered the boss flag yet, apparently. So I'm gonna probably go do this, and then it's gonna... Fuck, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea what that's gonna do. Let's just find out. All right. It did mention clearing out the dream, and I have seen this screen on ZQuest, so... What? Okay, I'm sorry. Why did that do something? And what was the point? I, I need to look at this. Hold on. Okay, so... There's... Nothing here. All of these are combo zero, which means they have no properties. Uh, yeah, something activated this secret. Also, what do you mean tile warp a cave item seller? Get the fuck out of here. Um, oh, I'm probably thinking way too hard about this, but... Sorry, I, I... For my perspective, I, like... I walked up to this person who I don't know who this is, and it just disabled this for some fucking reason. Ah, kill all enemies. 
trigger. That's it. Okay. Just going over here did it. So, all right. Um, uh, is this not a tile warp then? No. Why is it reading a tile warp on this screen? It says cave item. It says, yeah, screen 8A. So, is it just. I guess. Those must be. Tell? I don't know. Whatever. Fuck it. It doesn't matter. Okay, I think what's ha I think what I was supposed to gather here was. You know, I met up with Myra and Slardy Bart fast and whoever the fuck this is. And, you know, it made me happy and it opened this hole and now a beam of light has gone into this place and it is no longer going to be explodey and then maybe we fight fucking Proto Man or Zero or whoever the hell it is. The problem is, I'm short three rupees. You may think that that's stupid and it shouldn't matter, but remember, it's this fucking quest. It's going to matter. I, I can't be prepared enough for this. I... Yeah, I'm going on a whirlwind adventure. I, I just need to find some grass to cut. I just want to talk to him. I just want to shoot him. Where's some fucking grass I can cut, please? Oh my god. <laughs> this is so unnecessary. It's gonna... I'm not gonna need the money, and I'm gonna be really upset when I don't. Because I'm trying so hard to be prepared. How is there no grass fucking anywhere? I feel like it was all over the place in this place in this fucking forest. Oh. oh, oh, this is so stupid. Okay, whatever. I'll be back in a minute. You have no idea how long it took for me to actually get three rupees. It was kind of ridiculous. All right, and boss flag disabled. Okay, what do we got. Well, we know it's definitely Zero and not Proto-Man. Oh. Um. This is, uh... This is a very engaging battle. You know, my opponent seems to be frozen in time here, but, uh... All right, what do, what do I do? I like the hookshot just eating the... Can I just like blow you up or something? Well, your legs disappear with the lens. Can I just walk into you? No. What is this? Game, what do you want me to do? Oh. Okay, I didn't see that. Of course, you hammer the button. Uh. <sighs> Why? Why do I have to hammer them in a certain order? Why do I have to hammer them at all? Why is he just standing there firing at me? Oh. Oh. Um, okay. Kill orbs, because orbs are bad. They're, I mean, doing a fucking lot of damage to me, so... Probably gonna get three rupees from killing this, aren't I? I'm taking way too much damage from- yep, there it is, okay. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. It's not fine at all. I care immensely. You know, I've seen good custom boss fights. Uh, I don't know if this is one of them. What? What? Uh, oh my god. You're not gonna actually make me kill all these, are you? I, ju I just want the wand. Can I just shoot you? No. Can I shoot this? No. 
There's no fucking way you're gonna make me kill all these. But I guess I'm doing it. Maybe they'll only turn into one H. Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's still not. I, I keep saying things are fine. I don't... I'm not liking this boss fight. It's dumb. This dungeon was, you know, pretty cool. We had the powers of dreams here. We could have could have had anything at all, and you chose bomb excavation. Come on. I'm gonna have to use this potion at some point, but that's whatever. All right. Up. Oh, oh no! Look out! Okay. I'm glad that didn't fucking kill me mid cutscene. Oof. Was I supposed to do something there? Game. Warning. It, warning for what? Uh. What? You fucking what, mate? I mean, I see the tile. What? Oh, is this on a timer? Time to warp. It's gonna just... No? Game, y you gotta tell me what you want me to do. He's just standing there fucking exploding. Okay, I think there is a time... I, I need to see what the hell this screen is. I could stand here and try to figure it out, but... There seems to be a time warp, maybe. Maybe not. It's very unclear. Um, okay, whatever. We warp from here. Here's this. Here's the fucking hammer gambit. Okay, he does a slash, which I assume is damage combos. Yeah. Then... Here's just a whole bunch of Dig Dogger kids. He does a slash. Here's a bunch of... Oh, no. Then this is just... Better hope you're not standing on him. Time to warp. Here's just this. Kill the Dig Doggers. This shit. Which I think is unavoidable damage, actually. Because when you kill them all, or no, I guess it's all the 16s turn into stairs, right? Presumably that's what that is. Whatever. Okay, so yeah, you take your damage. You're here. Here's this shit. Slash. What was this one? Um, was this even a screen? What? Is that what I'm w was there anything on this one? What the hell is this? How Am I stupid? How did it... Did it skip a... F I I'm sorry, I'm, I'm like stammering here. I don't... So, the tile warp on this one, I killed the enemies, it did this, you know, we tile warp into, oh no, he slashes you, ah, and then, there's no, there's no tile warp, it's just, you know, after a second, it warps to the next screen, which is this. The only layers are for him, there's no flags evident on the screen. There's no enemies. There's no warps. What the fuck? I don't... I don't understand what happened. 
whatever. Moving on, apparently. Because something must have happened somehow. I wish I knew how or why. We get to this. Okay. So yeah, you have 12 seconds and it warps you to itself. That's... Or no, a damage screen and then back to itself. Okay. So I have to solve this puzzle in 12 seconds. Okay, now what the fuck is the puzzle? There's... Okay, reflected magic... I think is what that is. Sorry, game. Why? Okay, let's review. So, I assume shooting him directly would do nothing. Because Flag 77 is reflected magic only, I think. Is that correct? Hold on. 77. Yeah, magic, ref magic trigger reflected. Okay, so... We have... There's this thing which is just there for no particular reason. This is a magic mirror. 67 is no push blocks. 59 is push block vertical many. So... What? 52 is... Okay, so I was supposed to push this out of the way and then move this mirror down and then shoot the mirror to reflect it. I don't know why I was supposed to do that because there was no indication that that was what I was meant to do. But that was what it wanted me to do. But I didn't because I'm just like, nah, fuck this. This works just as well. Okay. Now that we've, you know, established that that's how this game wants to play, um, there's, I guess, just the prize. There's probably a timer here that I'm failing because I'm going super slow. Also, there's like a piece of wood. Oh. Okay, well, I mean, I'm fine with this. It's mixing things up. What the hell? It didn't mix things up for very long. What the fuck was that? I don't remember who Niara is. Can't let you make any more progress. Your error in the past must bring punishment. If you had if you had chosen your own path, you wouldn't have needed to go through all this. You did. No. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> I'm sure we've seen them before. I just don't remember at all. And what error? Like, okay, whatever. The next year, the blood line. If I'd chosen you, you would have gone through all the markers. Was this my ex? I'm I'm sorry. I'm just I'm just taking it all in. I have nothing to say about this. <laughs> Your bed was possessed by an evil spirit. Yeah, we saw the fucking flickering, you know, portrait of Zero earlier. It was like all of them mixed together except for one. I got I gotta specify that one. What? What about steaming systems? Also, I like how they just, you know, shoved me next to a boudoir after the little cutscene there. Oh my god. Well, you know what I'm doing. Well, getting attacked by a snake, but more importantly... Where's the inn? I don't remember which one it is.
I, I, I have to fucking know immediately. I should save this for another video, but I can't. What the hell does this do? Whoa! Ah! Uh. Whoa! Okay. This is probably Triforce piece number four. Those, those cutscene screens just fucking flew by so f <laughs> I had no time to process what was going on. Whoa! Okay. Whatever, let's just... Go ahead and... Yeah, we get to see it again, yeah. Yeah, castle. Yeah, rotating triangle. The king in the field. And now we're here. Oh no, you're bad! <laughs> I mean, okay, I won't, I guess. Also, what, what the fuck just flashed? Was that a test? Was it like, if you love me even a little, you won't go in? Okay, that's fine. gonna make me do it. So now, you know, uh, there's two routes this can go. Either it's gonna be like, like, oh no, secret dark side. Okay, no, there's three routes it can go. Secret dark side. Okay, sorry, the, the background was like flashing at an irregular rate, and it seemed like it was every time I touched this tile. No, it's so yeah. It's either you know, oh, she has a secret dark side. Oh my god. There's, oh, I told you not to look, and you did anyway. Uh. Or it's just gonna be something incredibly immature and be like, oh, oh, oh buff guys. Oh. <laughs> Great. That's whatever. We'll save it for next time. <laughs> I just wanted to see what the hell it was. A very stupid place to end the video, but whatever. I don't give a shit.